Hey guys, it's your girl Jalicia, and today I want to talk about my hair. I know that some of y'all might find it strange, and you know, you always give me compliments on my hair, which I appreciate, but my hair is getting on my damn nerves, okay? I feel like I'm in this weird hair length. This is about the length. Um, it's a little longer, probably about hair. I got my the hair folded under the beads. Of course, it's curly, you can't tell. But I swear to you, when I sleep, I cannot deal with my hair all over the place. Now, I know I should be tying down my hair, and I tell you guys to tie it all the time. But frankly, I just can't. Like, my hair has outgrown every single scarf that I used to tie my hair down with. I had a do-rag, little long lock sock thing. I outgrew that. And it's just, everything's tight. And if it's tight on my head, I cannot sleep. Like, no ma'am, no ham. So that's not working. Um, I try to put it in a ponytail, but as I told you guys before, my scalp and hair for some reason, ever since I've been growing these locks, it cannot take pair pins, ponytails, flat twists, braid outs, like anything that I have in my hair that I say I'm going to leave in for more than an hour, hour and a half. Forget it, okay? Headache city, I cannot deal. I have to take it out. I tell you this all the time. I do the styles for you guys, and I do style my hair when I go out, but I'm always taking my hair out, usually before I even get back in the car. I just can't. My hair likes to be wild and free. And while all of that's great and everything, that shit gets on your nerves. First of all, I live in Tampa. It is hot as hell. Like, it is 85 degrees below hell level, okay? And that was just today. <laughs> Also, I don't know if I'm going to the change or something, but I'm just sweating uncontrollably. Like, I get hot really, really quick. Hey, girl. Ask me, Ani. She can tell you. Yesterday, I was about to keel over. Okay. Hey, girl. But having hair all over your skin, trying to sleep, and the heat to me is a Molotov cocktail. Okay? Now, I ain't going to get crazy and say I'm going to cut it. But I've been like... Ah! A lot of times, but I am not going to cut my hair. Like, this right here, that's all you're going to do, boo. This is it. That's all. But, oh my God, it's so annoying. And I don't want to cut my hair and seem like I'm complaining, but I want to share it with you because I want people to know it is not all fun and games. The shit will get on your nerves, and it's just stuff that annoy you. Also, I've noticed that my hair has become so dry. And I'm not saying, like, it's dry, like, it's cracking, like, it's damaged, but... It's changing. The texture is changing. The porosity level is changing. It's just changing. And nobody told me that once your hair started growing and you get a certain length, your hair will change, develop an attitude, and want to go rogue. And that's what this thing is doing right here. It is going rogue. I love it. I've stopped. You know, I try to condition it and treat it as much as I can. As much as I can. But child, it is driving me crazy. Like right now, I feel like I'm getting so hot. And it's just such a my neck. <laughs> but I wanted to come and share that with you. Like I said before, A, to let you know it's not all it's cracked up to be. And B, to find out how do you guys sleep with your hair tied up? What do you use? What methods work for you? And that's especially people with my length or longer. Because if your hair is longer, oh my God, how do you deal with it? Okay, I can't. Deal, and I need some help. Yes. Hashtag Jalicia need help 911. Okay? So leave your information down below, and we'll chat back and forth, all right? <laughs> Thanks for letting me vent, guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace out. She works hard for the comments, so you better hit that like.